Traveler, Paimon. Could you go wait for me at that place with the view? I'll let Navia know that we'll be a little late. There's something I'd like to give you. A place with the view? Oh, Paimon knows where you mean. Sure, no problem. Perfect. I'll be right there. Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, we didn't wait long at all. But what did you want to give us that you couldn't share right in front of everyone else? Here. Take this. Oh, wow. A brooch! And in the style of Chiria Boutique, too! <gasps> Wait, Paimon gets one as well? I've only made two for now. After much consideration, I decided to give them to you two. You've been a great help. Even when things were looking bleak, you stayed by my side. There were even times when I felt like I had to fight back and win. Even if it was just to honor the trust that you had in me. Well, we may have helped a little, but Paimon would say you deserve most of the credit. This result, it was all you, Chiori. I know for certain that was not the case. I've chased my dream for so long that I've come to understand something. Apart from conviction and persistence, the thing that matters most is having friends who believe in you even when you don't believe in yourself. A single person can only do so much. Without all your help, Chioria Boutique could have easily fallen to ruin. Well, Hyman doesn't think it would have ever gotten to that point. Not if you had anything to say about it. But, um, about the stuff you said at the show, you aren't worried it'll rub some people the wrong way? Perhaps my words were a little pretentious, but they do reflect how I truly feel. I won't bow or scrape before any force in this world, much less any individual. I'm confident in the quality of my work. Create something beautiful, and there will always be people who appreciate it. Well, guess there's nothing to worry about then. Should we go back and join them at the victory feast? Oh, yes, of course. But before that, I'd like to admire the view for just a little while longer. You know, of all the nights I've spent in Fontaine, I'd say this is the loveliest by far. <sighs>